Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode. Today we are going to look at NECA's Russ Thorne figure and the Steelbook of Slumber Party Massacre in 4K from Shout Factory slash Scream Factory and the exclusive poster that comes with it. You can only get this set when you order it from Shout Factory online. So stick around. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome back. So today we are going to look at NECA's Russell Thorne figure from the 1982 cult film Slumber Party Massacre. It was released in January of 2020. It is still available as of December 2020. And it was released with the Steelbook Blu-ray limited edition and you get a poster along with it. The Blu-ray has a 4K transfer from the film's original negative, and it comes with a documentary and commentary from the actors, including Michael Vavella, who played Russell Thorne. The documentary Sleepless Nights, the making of The Slumber Party Massacre, also features commentary with director Amy Holden Jones. And it also has an interview with actor Rig Kennedy. And of course, it features the film's original theatrical trailer. You're pretty. All of you are very pretty. I love you. It takes a lot of love for a person to do this. The film's transfer looks spectacular. I thought it looked great, and I think a lot of fans of the movie will be really impressed with it. The artwork is really nice for the packaging on the steelbook. You really can't go wrong getting this set. It looks spectacular and you get this great poster. And of course you get what's coming up next. You get the Russ Thorne action figure. The packaging looks great. It features the original 1982 movie poster and a photo of the figure on the back of the box. He is displayed in a um, window display box, so you don't have to take him out. And there's no tape on the box, so you don't have to worry about any tape damaging the box. You can just open it up, slide the clear tray out that holds the figure, and there's only two pieces of elastic that runs across the waist and his legs. So let's pull the tray out. And here the figure is inside the tray as he is stored inside the box. I took him out so you could get a look at how he's in there. Now I have to admit, I am not a super fan of the Slumber Party Massacre. I have seen the movie a handful of times, but I'm not one of those big fans of the film. But when I saw this, I was very interested in having it in my collection because I like it well enough to have the movie with a good transfer. It's in 4K, like I said, and the figure looked very cool. So I thought I'd add it to my collection. I love NECA and I love this period of horror films in the early 80s, so I, I couldn't let it go by and miss it. The tailoring done by Sarah Martire is amazing on the costume. It's exceptional. It looks great. It really does. And the sculpt by Trevor Grove looks very much like Michael Vavella. He did an incredible job. It looks like him when that actor playing Russ Thorne makes certain facial expressions, it looks like him. Um, I wish they would have maybe did another head, like a, you know, a different sculpt with 
different expressions on his face because he you know, makes some crazy faces in the movie. And it would have been interesting to have like maybe another head to kind of switch out like when he smiles and his eyes get real big. But this sculpt looks really good. It looks like the actor, it looks like Russ Thorne from the Slumber Party Massacre. The hair maybe could have been a little more gray. It looks a little dark, but you know, that's minor. This is the face I'm talking about. I wish they would have did a head with that smile on his face, but look, I mean, they did such a good job with him. It's just maybe the hair should have been more gray. It should have been a little lighter rather than so dark. It also would have been awesome to have a wind up drill that you could wind up that would make a sound. And maybe the drill could spin around. And he also comes with the butcher knife. You could maybe let your Michael Myers Halloween 2 figure use this knife. Remember, if you order the set, you get this really great poster that comes with it that's really cool. Well, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. He's completely mad. Toys in the attic he has. Uh. Completely mad.